All right, I'm gonna make a two egg omelet using my dash egg cooker. So I have beaten two eggs and I have sprayed the omelet pan with some spray, nonstick spray. And I'm gonna take the dash measuring cup. I put it up above the water, up above the line, right above the line for omelet just because I wanna get um, it a little bit firmer. And pour that into the warming plate. Put my pre-greased or uh, cooking sprayed pan, uh, pan on top. I'm gonna pour half of the mix into the pan. And then I'm going to put a little bit of cheese into it. and some onions. I got my onion chopper that does not require me to do the onion chopping. Then pour the rest on top. Put the lid on and then push the button to start. Oh, I need to make sure it's plugged in. And now it's starting. And in about 10 minutes, we'll have a perfectly cooked omelet. So as you can see, there's steam coming out of the little steam hole in the cooker. Um, this whole system operates on steam cooking, which is um, healthier and it really makes the eggs uh, fluffy. Uh, this also can do hard boiled eggs and um, I used to do the hard, my hard boiled eggs with the steaming method on the oven uh, on the stove, but this way, uh, same concept of putting water in and then there is an egg holder in there and you can do up to six eggs just by steaming. You have to poke a little hole to get the air out of the egg before you steam it. Um, and there, there is um, a little pinpoint pricker here on the bottom of the measuring cup so that you can you can put that little hole in each of the eggs before you steam them. Um, you only have to do that when you're trying to make hard boiled eggs though, of course. Uh, but that you can see the steam rising. Um, and now the egg is done. I turn this timer off and lift it. Gotta be careful, steam is always really hot. But you can see how fluffy they are. And then you just take the cooking tray and the egg slides right out, and there you have it. Your fluffy omelet with cheese and onions. And uh, I guess the proof will be in the, uh, the pudding or the tasting. You put a little salt and pepper on, and you're good to go. So go Dash, yay!